What's up everybody, Gaming Gargoyle here, and welcome back to another episode of Farmer's Life. Hope everyone is doing fantastic and awesome, just hanging out with the wifey in the bedroom. Nothing naughty to see here. Uh, as always, thank you so much for the continued support for the channel. Going for the 2500, thank you so much. You guys know the... The the skit, you know, like, comment, subscribe, all that, jazz. you know it. Uh, so, big news, since the last time I had uh, recorded on Saturday, there was an update, so changes. The mayor decided to verify how the heck Casimir can earn money faster than him. He discovered many irregularities and introduced a new order. Interesting. Animals have discovered how tasty vegetables straight from the garden are. Keep animals away from your crops. Good to know. I hope I don't have to uh, pitchfork some chickens. Casimir learned how to plow without cutting the grass first. The work progresses slower, but if a man is persistent, he will plow even the most overgrown fields. The grass visibility in March was increased, which makes working the fields easier in the winter. Here, let's just get our sleep on till almost 7, so we'll get up at 6. Uh, Casimir learned how to fast travel while controlling a plow and under one circumstance he taught were impossible, like towing a tree log with a horse, for example. Casimir discovered how to disassemble the old woodshed by the house, just like any other structure he built himself. So, I'm guessing... Oh, great, we left the power on overnight again. I'm guessing they mean this building, but I like this building. Right, we're going to leave it here, even though we can replace all this woodshed stuff, I'm guessing. By putting one into here. Hmm... Casimir learned how to use a string to change stacks of hay or straw into handy cubes. Ask Johnny or Steven, so I know where Johnny is. Casimir can now grow mushrooms in his shed, so all you need to set up a proper station and supply some manure regularly. Alright, well, I think that's something that, that we need to do, don't you? I, I think that uh, growing some mushrooms is a great idea. But where to put it? Now, I'm thinking... Because we got this big old log here that I want to keep, maybe if we put a double station just in behind here, I think that should work out because we can still come up and around and go this way with the tractor. So, eh, the cogs are turning. So we might be growing some mushrooms by the end of this episode. Uh, it says you can no longer take off the meals off the stove before they're finished, which led to the disappearance of both the ingredients and the meals. So nice. Once you start cooking, you're locked into it. You can't uh, take it off early. Tractor accidents don't always require a placement part now, but have a wrench on you just in case. Good to know. Oh, that was driving us crazy. You know, you just have an area just spawn in on you and wee off you go. Boys, look like we have to repaint that roof again. Oh. It's horrible. The house looks horrible. Uh, state agricultural farm. Found out tobacco is a worthwhile resource. That must mean that they've uh, increased the prices. The threshing machine became more efficient and the cutter produced more logical amounts of fodder based on the ingredients it was given. We managed to make our game a little slimmer. It's less of a resource hog now. Loading times are noticeably shorter and memory usage is lower, reducing the chance of crashing to the desktop. So, we got 79 hours for the big guys. But for the little guys, we only got 29 hours. So we got a full day that we can go ahead and build a shed with. So I'm going to go over here. I'm going to grab myself a hammer. Oh, and we're going to need some planks, aren't we? Uh, you know what? We'll just take 50 for now. Uh, let's take a look and see what a double shed of uh, mushrooms looks like. Uh, don't be, be to build. E to build uh, other shed. Okay, so we need 60 planks and 32 asbestos boards. Those are asbestos boards? We only need 12 to start. Okay, well, with that being the case then, we'll go ahead and we'll put everything in here. And, oh, you put several animals in the pens already. Not cool, mom, not cool. All right, you know what? Let's share the work. Let's see. When you get home, gather eggs, milk cows, and then put the animals back into the pens. Sure. Sure. Why not? Let's see if that works. Ah, sometimes managing your lady is over. Anyway, uh, we are going to go into town. Now that everything's opened up. I will wait for everything to lop in here. Come on. Log in. Come on. How about if I look away? Yeah, oh. We'll go away again. How about now? Aha! There we go. There's everybody. Hi, Ann. What? No fighting? Whoa. Wow. 
wild. I wonder if he died. Anyway. Johnny, let us trade for some string. Spool of string is in Kate. In a capable hands, this thing is able to turn loose stacks of hay or straw into practical cubes. It gets tangled often and you want to throw it out at once. But the next day, something needs to be tied and you can't even find a short piece anywhere. Not sure what that's all about, but we'll grab these because I want to see what they're talking about. We might not get it to today's episode because the field still has 72 hours of growing. But that's fine. All right. Steven, let us trade for your string, please. And I will take 30 of your metals. Thanks, pal. Now, of course, we cannot forget Sophia. Sophia, Sophia, our first crush. I'm going to take your, your, your bombs, okay? And you know what? Your salt, just because we can. You know what? You do have vodka. Just, just so we can make some warming teas. That's all. No, don't. I'm not a drinker. I'm over those days. I can't just tell. I'm, I'm, I'm over it. Speaking of drinking, oh, I was gonna say, where's our mayor? Must be at the bar. Two hundred thirty dollars. Ooh, good thing we have another crop coming in, man. We went from thirty thousand down to six thousand, no, six and a half thousand, real fast. Okay, well, we got our string. We got our uh, metal. So, where do we want to put it? Because we do have to supply it with manure. We could put it there, but I was just thinking, wait a minute. Nah, I don't want to fit it there. Nah. No, oh, raining again. I tell you, it's like we're on the Pacific Northwest. Constantly raining. Constantly. Okay. Let's get rid of the things we don't need. So, string. Oh, I wonder how our bike fell down over there. All right. String. We'll just throw into here. Oh, so much string. Okay. So at the time of this recording, nobody has uh, gotten back to me yet on if I had forgotten or missed any other tanks or houses that we can explode. But that's probably because that episode isn't released yet. Just saying. Just saying. Alright, so. We need the hammer. We need, uh, was it 59? I think we need 59, so... Like that. I think that's all we need. I think. Now these two aren't straight with each other. Don't matter. It just has to do the job. Uh, two boxes? Oh, rotate. All right. Is it because of that other roof? I bet you it's because of the other roof. What if we go this way and then? Nope. Guess it might be that log. Or we want to turn it sideways here. Hmm. So that way we're with the light. I think we might go with the light. Let's get this turned to the same proper angle. Yep. All right. There. Perfect. There we go. Speaking of light, should we turn the light on to build this thing? I tells you. Hmm. Maybe we move it back just a little bit because it's getting kind of close to the road. Uh, so build. Now, since it was only 12... Uh, pieces to begin with. We got all our pieces back, so we're good. Let's try... Don't want to cut into that, but... There we go. Let's try that. 
Uh, no, I want you. Now, did I just see that my wood didn't come back? Hold on. Yeah, we have 14. I should have had 60, 20, 49. I don't know. I think we, I think we lost like 12 boards. We'll see. Yeah, I need like 30 more planks here. What the heck? Oh, I took 41. That's what happened. Okay. I see what happened. There was an error in my transitioning of uh, parts from one note to the other. Perfect. So we should have two boards left over, just in case. Always bring extras. Uh oh. Uh oh. We're gonna have to go into our pile and go get a couple more. Oh, uh, please tell me I have more than three. I have ten. Okay, good. Phew. This looks better. Perfect. Now we gotta paint it up. Yeah. Red and white. Can't go wrong with that. It's a 24 percenter. There we go. Oh, let's do the red first. Red's kind of hard to get in the right spots. There we go. And for the white. There we go. Nice. Yeah. Alright, so we'll put you in here. Put you in here. Now, I'm afraid that we're going to have to get some manure. So, let's put in a mushroom farm. Put in a mushroom farm. E to use. Ah, we got to drag manure in here. And then it'll pop up the harvest. Okay, cool. That being done, let's just take a quick run over to uh, Thaddeus and go get ourselves a big old uh, container, shall we? Nothing wrong with getting a big old container from Thaddeus. Making sure we're not being stalked by wolves. That's, that's kind of something that this game needs a little bit more of. I mean, yeah, that bear is freaking terrifying over at the church, but you kind of need like something like the foxes to come like chase after you or something. You know, just saying. Just add a little bit more, uh, more surprise in the game. I'm pretty sure Thaddeus, hey buddy. I'm pretty sure you had the big barrel, right? Yeah, you do. Thanks, pal. You don't have any more things for us, do we? Nope. We beat you in the cache. We're good. Oh. Hey, nobody said we could harvest these, so, uh, if they don't mind... I won't mind, you know what I'm saying? You don't mind, do you? I don't. Guess I should have brought more apples. That'll learn me. But we need more apples until they start coming through on our fields. In our orchard. See, it's been a while since we've been up here. Have we gotten something? Oh, we got two something-somethings. Got ourselves a little fox. Uh, oh, I don't want to, I want to pick it up. There we go. For some reason, it was like going, nope, you cannot have. Probably was just grabbing in the wrong spot for it. Knew something wasn't right. Okay. 
Yeah, we can pick this one, no problem. The fox must be just a little bit larger than the snare trap. It gave me a bit of an issue. Don't you remember it giving me an issue in the past, though. Alright, so we got the big barrel. So we'll go into the animal pen area. We'll go ahead, pull out uh, a big barrel of manure. And hopefully that'll work to fill the uh, mushroom farm. If not, we'll have to run back and get ourselves a small bucket as an empty bucket. Oh, what happened to all our manure? Is it all going to there? Oops. Well, uh, let's put the bucket down. What about right? here. No, you good? That's yeah, good. I don't know why these doors never stay open the way that you leave them. They're getting quite the collection of animals in here. It's gonna start stinking soon. <laughs> I haven't figured yet how to uh, send them home. Or, like, how to sell them, sorry. Sell, send them home? Sell them. And, you know, yeah, we're getting hungry enough. We can... No. Drink, thank you. Okay, so that is good for the moment. You know, I'm just gonna go buy another... Another bucket. I need a couple anyway. I need a couple. Reason being is I want to have five for the kitchen, five for the still, or four for the four for the kitchen, four for the stills, and one for milk and another one for manure. So I might as well. Now is it Thaddeus or is it Thaddeus's uh, lady there, Helen? I can't remember which one it was. We'll find out in a second. Whew, doing a whole launch of walking simulator here today. <laughs> That's fine. It's fine. Never stops raining. Always raining. Gonna get pneumonia. Hey, come on, son. Come on out. You can do it. I got faith in you. Daddy, you don't have any buckets, do you? No, just the big one. Thanks. Thanks, bud. Helen, standing out here in the rain. Yeah, that's what I thought. You did have a bucket. Thank you. Yep, just the type of guest you like. The paying type. Yep, gotcha. What was your profession again, Helen? What's with this about being paid? What? Hi, <laughs> I tell ya. Small town of Zalacy, it's, uh, it's got some interesting folks in it, that's for sure. So I'm wondering if I should pull out the animals and clean up the pens. All in the name of making mushroom manure. Yeah, I guess we'll do that. That way the missus can put them away again later. Because there's like nothing in here. Alright, we'll take you. Anybody home? Nobody in here. Anybody home? Nobody in here. Seriously, nobody in there? Okay. Well, we'll take you out. Here you go. What's your fatness at? Oh, you're 100%. Oh. But you got a baby. Do I... Do I do it, folks? I don't know. It would be cruel. Separate a calf and its mother. I don't know. I'm tempted. We got two cows. And a calf, from the looks of it.
We don't need too many animals around here, you know what I'm saying? Alright, calf, you're done. No waste, excellent. Easy to clean up after. Alright, nothing in there. Alright, let's take you out first. Come on, attaboy. Attaboy's done, and... Yep, he left us a surprise. Come on, Fluffies. Come on, Fluffies. Yep, come on, not a racer. There you go. Good on you. Oh, wrong button. Went to press Z and uh, I ended up pressing Winders. How did I miss a fluffy poop? Another animal out while well, we throw some manure, more manure in here. There you go. I see a little piglet. He'll be baking in no time. One more cow after this. Sorry, Bessie. Didn't mean to poke your eye out there. My bad. What about you, Bessie? You coming? You want to go outside? Yeah, I figured you might. There you go. Bessie 1 was clean. Bessie 2 was clean. And we got no more animals. How about animal waste? Well, there's some in here. That looks like it. All right. Good job, animals. All right. Get rid of you, but we'll take you. Might as well make them look pretty once in a while. Clean, clean. Wow, these guys are pretty dirty. I'm glad I'm cleaning them. I'm almost tempted to go sell these guys, but I don't know how to sell them. I'm not sure. You know, let me know in the comments down below. Why, these guys were filthy, and it's only been like three days since I cleaned them. I didn't think it's been that long. What were you guys doing? I know it's always raining and it's always muddy here, but. You don't have to get filthy this quick. Come on, guys. Come on. Have some self-respect. Oh, okay. Are you feeling left out? Don't worry. I'll get you clean, too. There you go. There you go, not a racer. Look all nice and pretty for your uh, Mr. Fluffies. Yeah, the boy. It don't matter what you look like, right? You get all the women. Look, clean. Oh, I think I got not a racer. I think you're following me. Oh no, sorry, Bessie. Didn't mean to wipe you there. You got that covered yourself. You and your tail. All right. I think that's all the animals clean. that in there and I guess we need to do the slow walk of shame 
I just stepped on it. <laughs> stepped on a chicken. You're lucky you ain't dead, chicken. I'm carrying like a ton of uh, feed here. Well, not bad, not bad. Oh, they're all okay. That one's full. Huh? They eat from the right to the left, apparently. The chickens are a little finicky. Let's see what the pow, uh, the pigs are doing here. So, yeah, the animals now, I guess, eat a little differently, if I'm reading the Discord correctly. I guess they eat uh, a little bit more, so if you have, like, just hay in the uh, feeder, they'll go through a lot more of it. If you have, like, the, the fodder or whatever, I guess they go through it less, because it's higher nutritional based or something. I'm not 100% sure. But, yeah, if you read on the Discord, apparently that's, uh, it's a thing. Alright. There we go. Let's see what we can do. Alright, we got one. No, I don't want to splash it. Can't do it without a bucket. I will not use my hand for this. Okay, so if I go F. I go... Pour in the barrel, pick up, fill it up, or destroy all the contents. I want to fill it up. Need an empty bucket first. E. Okay. Okay. Over here, fill it up. Okay. Right. So that wasn't that hard. All right. Hey, Bessie. Uh, you, we're probably going to need the bucket for this. Just, just saying here. So let's pick this up. Uh, shoo, 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 shoo. Out, 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 out. Don't need to be in here. Go enjoy the sun. Worse than a ten-year-old kid. Okay, so if I come over here, and I go... Place you down. Like, say, here. Now, how does this work? E to use... Uh, I gotta use a bucket in order to get it. Okay, so. Come into here. 100%. 86 hours to get 10 mushrooms. Okay, it's gonna take a little while. Get that back here. Where do you think you're going, young barrel? I don't think we got enough in here to fill it. Yeah, no. Let's see, are you empty? No, you're not empty. There we go. Alright. I I can throw this somewhere, so let's, uh... Let's just choose over here. There. Increased our manure ratings. This is going to be a pain in the bucket. Alright, pick you up. I'm going to set you down over here. So I don't walk into you all that often. Then... Oh, nope. Take this bucket. And put you there. It's going to be a while before we need to uh, fill that up. 90 hours worth. Oh no! The missus needs a bike. We have a bike, but the missus doesn't. Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. That's just not right. Uh, what do you mean you can't put the bike here? How about here? There we go. Yeah, I know what the missus wants. The missus wants a brand new white bicycle. So we better go get Marie one. Just wait until she starts asking for a tractor. Nah, <laughs> then we're gonna have to sit down and have a talk. <laughs> you want a tractor that badly? You can help throw in the money for it, lady. Just saying. Just saying. Oh, hot chocolate. Delicious. But we have a, a really good working, just fine tractor as it is now. Yes, I know it steers all over the bloody place, but that's a developer thing. That's not an us thing, dear. We have no control in this game in order to straighten up that steering. God, that steering is horrible. Now, I'm pretty sure Thaddeus 
Thaddeus, you had a bike, right, buddy? Right? You do? And it's only $560? Alright, well, we'll take it. Vehicle's yours to be driven home. Alright. We don't go home that way. We go home this way. Gotta make sure that everything's working in order for, uh, for Marie. You know, we don't want to give her a defective product. It'd come from Thaddeus and all. But, uh, so far, yep, yeah, it's riding pretty smooth. No squeaks. She wants to put any bells or brakes or anything like that on it. You know, the non-essentials. She can go ahead and do that, too. But for now, we'll just get it home and try to sneak it home before she gets there. And then we'll put it out front right by her favorite standing spot, right by that power breaker. And we'll see if she notice. See if she's uh, surprised with her gift. I bet you she won't even notice. Always thinking about her. Keeping her in our hearts. Oops. Uh, how about we try that again? Alright, that's better. Uh, paint. Where's my 24% paint? It's 14% now. Close enough. There we go. A white bike for the missus. Put it right up in front here. So she can see it. We got matching his and her bicycles. Alright, so. We got the mushrooms done. Woo! Uh, we got... Like another full day to wait on these, uh, vegetables, right? 19 hours, yeah, so they're not going to be ready. 20 hours. These 20 hours. How come some carrots look, uh, more grown than others? Just saying. Onions. Oats. Alright, so hopefully, uh, I'm keeping my fingers crossed that when we bring our vegetable tiller, th or vegetable picker through here, we're not going to be ripping up any of these oats or uh, wheat. I think, yeah, there's wheat and oats mixed in here. If I remember correct. But, look at the size of this field. Look at the size of this thing. Glorious, simply glorious. Now, I'm... Hoping with an asterisk that the uh, the plowing now with uh, now we are able to plow over the grass, even though it's slower, but we can actually do it. I'm wondering if that's going to help save my frames, or if the developers already went through and worked on it so that it's not as uh, not as frame rate intensive. I tell you, not being able to go in a straight line. <laughs> frustrating, frustrating. Let's go over here and take a look at our other other plants. It's only June, so we might have some some raspberries and blueberries over from here. Yes, we do. Oh, okay. I'm hitting here just tap and E as fast as possible, and it's just a one-click shop here. There we go. Not too many, not too many. Now uh, it'll say that these will be ready in the fall, right? Yep, apples will get round and red in the fall. Thanks. As if we didn't know that. Woohoo! We got mushrooms. We got a wood shop, a wood shop and shop, and then we got our workshop just over here, so. Sweet. And we didn't have to rip up any of our our items. Look at that. Look at that. It was like it was born to be there. Now, if it wasn't for these silly little ramps and this hunk of wood here, I'd love to be able to get rid of this hunk of wood. Have a uh, workshop. 
without this, like, these ramps, these ramps can go to hell as far as I'm concerned. I much prefer just being able to walk in on the dirt. I can understand for like the animal pens or something, but for me personally, eh -eh, I don't like it. That's looking good. These are going to take us 90 hours. Yay. 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 90 hours in game. It's going to take forever. Let's come on over here. Get rid of you. And you. Wifey's not going to be back for another two hours, so let's go catch a one hour nap. Might as well just helps boost up our stamina just that little bit more. Oh, we must be saving. Yep. Been a while since I saved, so... Yep, and save me from evil. If you see that, you know you've saved. Okay, we're going to do... Two of the cancer sticks. I know, I know. I'm not the developer who decided that that was the best way to make your wife happy every night. You know, have a cigarette. Yeah, uh, it's more of a... The foreplay, I guess, is what she wants with the cigarette. I don't know, but it's what makes her smile. What makes her happy. Uh, she's going to be gathering some eggs when she gets home. Let's not worry about that. As soon as she gets home, what we'll do is we'll uh, get her working on milking. Then she can put the animals away because the animals are done. They've been taken care of. She can milk and then, um, yeah, put the animals away in the pens. Jackins, get out of my way. My foot is heavier than your bone density. Just saying. There are birds. Your bones are hollow. Wow, not so many eggs, huh? Now, I haven't seen any baby chicks run around or anything like that. Are there baby chicks in this game? Oh yeah, something else I noticed on one of the contracts that uh, Anthony had that one day when we were looking through. It said cockerels. I haven't seen a single rooster yet. So, is that something that we have to go buy? Because I'm pretty sure we don't have one. That's the case. We'll have to go do it tomorrow. Look. Essie. Or whoever you guys are. Come on. Come over here. There you guys, uh, girls are. There you go. Just stay out of there. Come on. There's no reason for you guys. Yeah, no, you too. Get, 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 skedaddle. Skedaddle. I swear to God, I have no idea how the chickens get out. But every once in a while, I'll catch a chicken just running around through these trees back here. Like, what are you doing? How many more hours till these trees are ready? Oh, these ones are ready for this winter. Oh, excellent, excellent. So, you know what we should do? Hold on. I'm going to do this. I'm going to grab one from each. And we'll let the missus pick them clean here. So, wifey came back home. Uh, we won't get her gathering eggs. But we will get her harvesting fruit from trees and bushes and milking the cows and goats. As soon as she's done taking the animals in the pen, she doesn't need to do it again tonight. So, let's see how that works out for her. Ah, oh, wow. Huh. Well, that was pretty good, actually. I'm, I'm, I'm impressed that we got this building put in, so... Yeah, I think... That's probably where we're going to end things off here today, folks. As always, thank you so much for the likes, the comments, subscribes, being a big, huge support, getting me towards the 2,500 goal. You guys are just drilling it in. It's awesome. Thank you so much. You guys are making that goal ever closer. So you guys, greatly appreciated. Special huge shout out to all these names on the credits that are going flying by. These are the channel members. You guys are awesome and amazing. You make it possible for me to continue to do what I do. Thank you. Very humbling indeed. So no matter where you are in the world today, I hope you have yourself a wonderful morning, evening, afternoon, good night. Thank you for taking the time to kick back, relax, unwind with me, and I'll see you in the next episode.